Meanwhile, in Broward County, the school board has voted to make face masks optional at high schools. NBC6 reporter Nicole Lauren is live with us this morning with a look at some of the changes we can expect to see. And is there any timeline that we know on when these changes could happen, Nicole? Okay, well, yeah, face coverings for elementary and middle school students are still going to be required, but now starting on Monday, it's going to be optional for these high school students, like you just mentioned. Now, the school board still moving forward with this change, but they still say they strongly recommend students wearing the face coverings. We do know students will be able to follow this opt out process, and some Broward County parents still do have some concerns their kids can easily spread the virus. We did speak to Dr. Osgood, a Broward County School Board member who says the vaccination rates have helped make their decision a little bit easier. Now, some other parents we spoke to are on board with the change, others not so much. We have seen a huge increase in the number of individuals in Broward County that are vaccinated. If some of the kids have vaccines and it's supposedly be saved, uh, I see no reason to wear a mask. We've got the elderly at home. Uh, we want to not bring anything home to them. Now, Miami-Dade could follow suit of Broward County pretty soon. Superintendent Alberto Carvalho saying that they are considering relaxing their mask policy, but they're waiting for more data to be released. In Fort Lauderdale, Nicole Lauren, NBC6 News.